Hi, welcome back to another YouTube video. We're just going to have a really quick look at Google Office Lens, um, which I currently don't have in my all app section at the moment. So basically, this is an app for um, taking pictures or looking at things, and Google gives you information about it, and it works really, really well. So, for example, if I just get this game controller of the kids here, and I can take a picture of it with the little magnifying glass icon. And it tells me, yeah, it gonna, there we go, it's a little bit slow. Um, it's a come up with some information about PlayStation 4. So it's not got that quite right because it's not a PlayStation 4 controller. But if I click on this shopping option here, I apologise, it's a little bit of a bit of a delay on my uh, recording soft on my phone software. Um, just try and line up a little bit better and take a picture of that then eventually hopefully just bear with me there's a slight delay and there we go it's come up with the exact control it tells you where you can get it from how much it costs um, we got a little bit cheaper than that actually maybe it's not quite the same controller but very clever um, <coughs> it's got an option on there for if you're dining and you want to point at dishes on your menu obviously I haven't got any of those to hand at the moment <coughs> excuse me it's got a text option so if I uh, just happen to have some text to hand. It will then uh, spare me a second. Being super slow, it will find the text on there. It says text found an image. I click on select all, and it actually puts the text on the app. Um, there we go. Tesco pair cider. Very clever. And then the other thing you can do with it as well is it will translate different languages as well. So I've got a leaflet here just from a, a cycle helmet from uh, Decathlon. It's got all loads of different languages on it. Uh, but if I just point it at, say, some of the text over here, hopefully, if it's working... Ah, I'd help if I actually put it on the right mode first. Spare me a second. So I'll put it on the translate option. I don't need to think about it. Uh, this might not work. There we go. I'll toss a look at that. So it should come up on my screen in a moment. There's just a little bit of a delay. There we go. So it's basically it's translated the Japanese uh, and puts it down in in, uh, in English, which uh, super clever. It's not perfect, obviously, but considering it's doing that pretty much on the spot just through my camera on my phone, it's uh, it's done a really good job. So really clever little app. So that's Google Lens. If you haven't used it before, um, check it out because it's well worth uh, well worth having a look at. Um, there are a couple of, op of options and things in there. You can put pictures and things on there and, and look at those, and it will give you descriptions and that sort of thing as well. But um, so yeah, that's basically it. So uh, take a look at that one if you get a chance, and that's about it. So thank you very much. Bye.